Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me. My name is Cougar. Now as you can see here, this is a Hoffman Richter product. Uh, and uh, these products, uh, at least this, this grouping and uh, the ones that are from here, are going to be from Survival Life. Uh, of course, if you guys want to check stuff like that out, uh, their, their website and stuff will be down there in the description below. But uh, let's go ahead and get this out and uh, check out what we've got inside. And uh, as you can see already, it is a knife. And uh, it's already in a hard sheath. But then we also had a secondary sheath that was sent to us as well. And uh, I'm not exactly sure if that's supposed to be like that or not. Because it uh, kind of threw me off the way it looks. But uh, anyhow, as you can see here, we've got the, uh, the nice... Uh, type of plastic or polymer type of, uh, of uh, sheath here. It does uh, lock into place. Obviously, it does not come out uh, as it is. You, of course, have all of the eyelets here, so you can uh, strap it in if you want to. Uh, it also has a uh, belt clip here. Uh, you can feed your belt through, or it does actually open up a little bit right here, so you can just snap it down on your belt and uh, you know it does hang down a little bit so that uh, it's not too high up on your waist. Now to see the blade, as you can see, is right there. Now this is an all metal piece so the uh, grip section is metal just as much as the blade uh, and as you can see this is a basically a Tonto style but uh, it, uh, it's not straight obviously here it does have kind of an arc uh, to it. Gives it kind of an interesting look. Uh, this is also a great knife I think that would be for uh, camping and, and general survival as well. Especially seeing as how we've got uh, some of these areas, this area here. Uh, you do have this point here, you've got the two eyelets here. Those are set so that you can take and uh, lash this onto the end of uh, a stick or a pole of some type and uh, use it as a spear. Now the coating here as you can see it is gray coating and the gray coating as I understand it is actually a titanium coating. It's, uh, it's there to help kind of uh, reinforce it slightly. Um, I don't know how much it actually does for the knife in terms of uh, making it stronger or anything like that or even making the edge last longer but uh, that is uh, kind of one of the features there. We do have, of course, uh, two, uh, two rivets there that do go all the way through. Uh, we have the, of course, thumb groove here. Uh, I have a nice set on the uh, thumb there. My uh, forefinger here does kind of lock right into place right there. This does have a very nice feel uh, in my hand. And uh, just to mention, this is a extremely weighty and I'll show you a little bit about that here in just a second. Uh, now it does of course have the, uh, the little opening there at the back. Uh, of course you can uh, throw on a lanyard if you'd like. And uh, you know if you wanted to, uh, just to kind of have some of that cordage, like I said you can use this for uh, maybe for a spear or something like that. That's part of what that is. But uh, you could of course always wrap it in cordage and uh, you know make maybe the handle a little bit thicker if you want it to be. I fe it feels a little bit thin to me, personal preference, um, especially with uh, the heft of this knife. Uh, but, uh, you know, and then also you, of course, we can uh, feed it down through and have the lanyard there. Uh, so depending on how you want to utilize it. Now, as you can see here, you can see how thick this thing is. Now this thing is a minimum, I think it's at least a quarter of an inch thick. If I remember correctly, when they used um, the, uh, it was on the site or something like that, I think they used literally four quarters, uh, like a stack of four quarters, and that's how thick this blade is. And uh, so assuming each one of those quarters is roughly a sixteenth of an inch thick, uh, we've got uh, a quarter of an inch of uh, material of, of steel. Now I do believe this is a so just to tell you what quality uh, type metal is in this and what kind of steel 
is in this. Uh, so they definitely didn't skimp on that. Uh, of course, you can see here it does have the uh, the Wolf logo there for the Hoffman Richter brand. So uh, very nice. Uh, it, it's it's heavy. It, it, it really with as thick as this is, it is very heavy. Um, I'm going to say this thing is probably right around two pounds. Uh, I, I mean, maybe maybe a little less, maybe a pound and a half. Um, but uh, it's definitely got a lot of weight to it. Um, it does have a nice movement here. It's definitely something that can be used for kind of a chopping motion. Of course, if you guys want to check this out again, I'll leave a link down there in the description below. It may give you a few things that I've forgotten or missed uh, in terms of ideas on how to uh, utilize this and uh, what it can be uh, good for. Uh, now, I did notice this is a very sharp uh, blade, so uh, let's go ahead And uh, yeah, that um, that took off a good bit of hair right there. That's a smooth shave. I mean, that's that's all that hair is gone. Um, now, like I said, this looks to me a little odd. Um, I don't know if this was actually supposed to come with it. This is a soft, more of a soft case type of uh, uh, type of uh, holster. Um, but uh, I don't know that this is quite the right one for this blade. I don't know if this was an accidental thing or if it just happens to be one that uh, we can just happily put um, another knife in here. Uh, this, it does, okay, we'll see it all the way down. Let's see if this will close up on it. Um, well, there we go. So it does fit. It's just a little awkward for the, I mean, because it is made for more of a standard blade, um, maybe a, a drop or a clip point type blade. I, I would think maybe more of a clip point. Uh, I mean, you even still see a very, very small edge of the blade right there still sticking out just a bit, uh, not much. Now it is long enough. Uh, it does have the length on it, so it does work. But uh, personal preference, I think I'm gonna go ahead and use the, uh, the hard case there. So uh, Hoffman Richter, they, uh, they seem to be making some uh, pretty nice knives. Like I said, you can check this out. This is the uh, from Survival Life. And uh, you know, if you guys uh, want to see it again, down there in the description below. Uh, also, while you guys are down there, you can check out our social media. But uh, then, uh, you know, once you're done down there, why don't you come on back up and uh, you know hit that thumbs up button we definitely appreciate it when you do that as well as hitting that little uh, icon down there in the corner or hitting that subscribe button down below the video and uh, of course you know if you haven't done that already as well as hitting that bell icon to let yourself get notified when we got new videos coming out here on world of me all right well you know that's going to do it for me today my name is cougar and this is the world of me but uh, I'd like to wish you guys all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye!